Okay guys, we are live again at Josh Gaming. Um I'm just about to cure myself of vampirism again. For the third time, I think. So I decided that I decided that before I go at it I show you guys how. So what's happening? Okay. So in order for you to get rid of vampirism Oh wait, they're fighting something Oh mad crabs Okay What the hell? Wait. <coughs> Sorry guys for the interruption and again If you want to get rid of vampirism here in Skyrim One of the methods, at least the only one that I know is for you to go to mortal so Mortal is located at this location. Her solitude. And here is Mortal. So you need to go to this place. And then you need to go to the inn. These vampires are becoming a real menace. Uh -huh. Here we go. More side inn. The reason why you need to go to more side inn is because there's a specific person in this place. That you need to speak to. And he will tell you about the vampirism because he's an expert at it. His name is Falion. I'm just not so sure now where his exact room is. Okay. There ain't much to offer. But if you want to play spend the night. Before I started this live stream, I was already able to talk to him. So what we're going to do now is just wait for him. Ah outside the outskirts of this town so but if it's your first time to get cured by a vampire you need to go to mortal talk to falion at this more side in then there will be a specific place Trouble. over this bridge right here where you can meet him then you will need a black soul gem black soul gem uh, I think he has one for sale, but if you already have one, you need to kill someone with it. So the soul of the human that you will kill will go to the Black Soul Gem. Okay, And if you already talked to him with the Black Soul Gem, you should meet him here at dawn. So I already did that. So I'm hoping that I will meet him again at this location. Or if not, then I'll have to find him again at the specific location at the marsh portion of the forest. Which is not far from Mortal, by the way. So, it's okay. So, let's see if we'll be able to find him right away. Or if not, we'll go further out. Ouch. What business do college mages have in a place like Sorthal anyway? It's a place for no death. Embrace of Shadows added, see? Once you're a vamp vampire, you will regain, or you will gain actually, some skills that can only be acquired if you are a vampire. However, there are some drawbacks which I really don't like. First of all, you, will, you won't be able to regenerate your magicka and life points while you are a vampire. So, you always have to wait for dark to come. So this is the place. This is the place where you will meet Falion. Is it Falion or Falion? I think it's Falion. See, it's near near the outskirts of Mortal, but he's not here right now. I said to meet him here at dawn. So I guess I just have to look for him first. father died years ago. Falion takes care of me now. Oh, it's Falion. <laughs> Lightly armored means light on your feet. Smart. He should be here somewhere, so... I'm gonna try and wait for him again. Maybe at 5.30. 
But if it's still not here, then I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> anyway, let's get on with it. Got on with it. So 9 a.m. Hmm, let's wait. You see, the exact time that Falion, Falion will come here is from 3 a.m. up to 7 a.m. So, you should be able to meet him here. I just don't understand why he's still not at this place but he should be here from 3 a.m. up to 7 up to 7 a.m. oh there oh oh here he is his first falion but I don't know why he's going back it's only my talents are much needed here. Morthal is a troubled place. It's my duty to see it rest in peace. Oh, mm. let's try again from 3 a.m. Hopefully, I can meet him. Meet him there. I guess remember, uh, once you already spoke to him and you already have a black soul filled gem, you just need to go to that place here in Morthal. So he's he's available for curing your vampirism between 3 a.m. up to 7 a.m. Oh, <laughs> do you see that? <laughs> so there again, uh, it's now 3 a.m. So I'm gonna wait for him at the same circle where we've been through a while ago, hoping to catch him in time. It's 3.44 a.m. Hmm. This is this place is starting to get creepy, but Not a little horror game. I'm still gonna wait for him though. See, I'm just not sure exactly wh where he will come from, but at least I know the place where he's going. Could that be him? Nope, that's a guard.
still not here. There he is, finally. So guys, let's see, hopefully he will perform the ritual now. The time right now is 4.43 a.m. So I guess he, it took him a while to go here. Okay. My talents are much more. Morthal is a troubled place. What I am doing is none of your business. Why are you here? Did you follow me? I demand that you leave at once what? and never speak of this again. It is none of your concern. Wait, this is you? I assure you. Just forget that you ever saw me here. <laughs> is that so? I should have expected. Wait, this much. is something you. Fine, I shall give you. I never gold had this conversation you with him shall before. Shall leave me in peace. Now go. Leave me to my work. What? That's nice. <laughs> I, I didn't know we, we can have that kind of conversation with him. It's only... Or at least it's always just to cure my vampirism. Please remain indoors at night. I know many things. I've studied things beyond the reach of most humans. There Traveled you. the oblivion plains. Seen things one should not see. I'm all ears. I know many things. I have stuck. I have met Daedra and Dwemer and everything in between. And I. It is possible. I know of a oh, ritual. Oh, I thought I already clicked the. It requires a this conversation for cure. I guess not. <laughs> so sorry, guys. But here it is. Kill someone. When you have a gem and have filled it, return to me and I will perform the ritual. I will bring life to your dead body, vampire. Sure, but I know I already have a black soul filled gem, so hopefully... My talents are much needed here there, in order see? to keep Morthal... You can either safe. purchase it for 355 gold, black soul gem. But for my case, I already brought one. I already killed someone for it, so here we go. Very well. Meet me at the summoning circle in the marsh at dawn. We shall banish the creature you have become. Mm -hmm. Good, you're here. <laughs> it's already done. So guys, here it is. Here's the ritual for you to have to be cured of vampirism. So let's just watch this. It's very quick. As you desire. I call upon Oblivion Realms, the home of those who are not our ancestors. Answer my plea. As in death, there is new life. In Oblivion, there is a beginning for that which has ended. I call forth that power. Accept the soul that we offer. As the sun ends the night, end the darkness of this soul. Return life to the creature you see before you. The ritual is complete. There we go, guys. So after that, you have already been cured of vampirism. So that's it. 
so just remember if ever you need to be cured of a vampire just go to mortal look for this person my Falian. talents are much needed yeah. here in order to keep then you can either buy the place. black soul kill gem from him or get one yourself kill a human store the soul of that human to that black soul gem then go back to him at mortal speak to him then meet him at that place mm. north of mortal between 3 a.m. to 7 a.m. then he will perform the ritual for you okay so that's it that's how you cure vampirism in Skyrim so this is one method I think there's another one but I only do this one okay so there finally now I'm not a vampire anymore again hey and now that we're cured of vampirism we can finally kill some dragons <laughs> Oh god, let's do this. Okay, so just to recap guys, a while ago our, the quest that we did was Retrieve the Horn of Georgian Wind Color, which obviously failed. <laughs> but someone already someone already took it. So we're just gonna continue with this one and meet with whoever took the horn. Which reminds me where that is. Where could that be? After demonstrating my ability to learn words of power and to shout, the greybeard Erngel sent me on a final trial, retrieving the horn of Georgian Wind Collar from his tomb in Ustengrab. Unfortunately, when I reached the tomb, I found that someone had replaced the horn of Georgian wind color with a note asking me to meet them in the sleeping giant inn in Riverwood. So Riverwood it is. I think it's somewhere here. If I recall correctly. Oh, it's Rolex dead. Where is Riverwood? No, this is Falkry Halgen. Ah, uh, here. Ah, uh, yes. I remember now. It's the first town that we've ever been to since that dragon attack at Halgen. fighting okay I have a lot of respect for the restoration school Skyrim could use more healers I thought they're attacking me <laughs> hey horse what good to see there college majors having a place like Sarthal anyway it's a place for North Bay okay here's Riverwood and this should be the inn okay ah shocks it's gun Hail cities! <laughs> Hi Boxycat! Shout out to you Boxycat, thanks so much for being here with me. I'm trying to finish the campaign now by the way. Doing the Horn of Georgian Wind Color quest. So Let me just save the game since this is a major quest. Maybe there's something important that will happen. Let me just save the game. Hail cities! <laughs> You're new around here, so I'll go easy on you. But don't get on my bad side. <laughs> Slipping your hand in again. Is this it? This is looking good. Feindall uh, thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius. Having away from fun. Me. <laughs> She's okay. already mine, I keep telling you. You're good that visitor been poking around. Hey. 
Like a traveler, someone that has seen far away places. You and Fane though both look both like the same girl, okay? I thought it says you and Fane both look like the same girl, okay? There's somewhere I can buy fresh supplies again. Lucan's got a little bit of everything in the Riverwood tree. If you need weapons or armor, see Alvor, the black How come at the I Bard's did College this in Solitude. before? They train me. If you go there, talk to Viarmo. He's the head. Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. B. Yeah, Legia is so hot. Just kidding. Wait. This What's is an orc drinker like you doing out here? Go yeah. home to your mother. Oh yeah. You shouldn't. Ah, uh, this is interesting. Watching you is fun. Oh, thanks, Boxycat. Uh, Boxycat, which one would you choose? <laughs> one for sorry, I'll be leaving now. Press two if you shouldn't talk to me like that. <laughs> I'm gonna make you guys choose what I should choose. <laughs> I hope you can hear me right now, Boxy Cat, but... That guy's Ven, that's the quest I told you about to get free archer training. Oh, yeah! I remember now! So I was here, okay. Good to know. Yeah, we'll... We'll try that. Um... Well, do you want a fight? Um, I'm I'm good with fighting. I always like a fight, but I just want you guys to right. choose something. We got rooms and food. Drink. I, I mean, too. I mean, I'm okay I'm with cool. whatever decision Ain't much else to you tell. want. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home. Just curious. So it's like we're all playing. <laughs> the the quest of the elf. Okay. Let's see here. So I'm gonna I'm gonna speak to this orc and this lady right here later because we'll be doing the quest of Buxicat. Last time it was the quest of Soul the Reaper, now it's Buxicat. <laughs> Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. It She's probably would have been a fist fight. Okay, thank you. But we'll do it later. Um let's do this first. We're gonna do the Sven Archery thing. You look like a traveler. Someone that has seen faraway places and heard new stories. Lucan's got a little bit of everything. If you need weapons or armor, see Alvor, the blacksmith. Sven. Give me a mug of ale. Coming right up. But, hmm. I need some more ale. At the Bard's College in Solitude, more than they train bards and skulls like myself. If you go there, talk to the armor. I'll find He's the headmaster. You, I always do. Free archery so training. No Wait. Mm. Feindal. So you All just right, need then. to find Feindal. I'm the right? innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Oh, what do you want? <laughs> Where is Feindel's house anyway? You should know where Feindel's house I've been trained as a scald. As Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. Riverwood trader, okay. Sounds persistent. Why not do something about it? Okay. Yes, two people spending time together never blossoms in the courtship. So which one should we choose so we can get the free archer training? I remember you saying that we should side with the elf. Okay. Yeah, so I think he sounds persistent. Why not do something about this? Will bring us to the elf. Maybe so right. Let's do that. Camilla may see Then we betray him when we were with the elf. <laughs> but 
why take chances? Here, give Camilla this letter. It's full of venomous nonsense. Tell her it's from Fando. Okay. Optional, tell Findal about Esven's letter, which is what we're going to do. Mm -hmm. So, shit, where's Findal? <laughs> yeah, he got, I already got the letter. I got, basically, I already got the letter. So, we're going to do the optional quest, which is to go to Findal instead of the girl. So, where could that be? <laughs> I'm just gonna check my quest list. Where's that quest? I bet the miscellaneous? Ah, oh, there. So now we need to find where Findal is. Okay, I'm. Hmm. I'm not very familiar with Riverwood, but this is a small place. I think we'll be able to find it. Try the wood mill place first. Okay, thank you so much. We'll do. Wood mill, I think it's somewhere here. Anyway, Riverwood is a small town. I think it's okay to explore it a bit. I'm sure we'll be able to find it. So. Off to dragons again <laughs> or jumping clips. <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, here we go. Unlock final south apprentice. What time is it? Uh, 6 08 pm. So let's wait an hour. Maybe he'll be at home at night, maybe in the morning. Oh, it's still locked. I don't want to unlock it. So, yes, let's try going to the house. Of Findal at about 8 30 a.m., probably. <laughs> then maybe we'll be able to meet him. I mean, I can always unlock the door, but I'm a good, I'm a law abiding citizen for now. I kill thugs. Oh, there. Riverwood's agreeable enough. Oh, I suppose. hello, Findal. Books the cat sent me. <laughs> There's beauty here, unmatched in all of Skyrim, to be sure. Oh yes, I'm sure. Because Booksy Cat told me that you'll teach me some archery training. Sven wanted me to deliver this letter to Camilla saying it was from you. What is that blowhard up to now? So, he thinks he can turn Camilla against me. Two can play at this. Here, give this letter to Camilla and tell her it's from Sven. <laughs> Let's see what she thinks of him after reading that. I. <laughs> so... Delivers that final starter to Camilla. Okay, thank you so much, Booksy Cat. We're a small um, village. so now guys, we're off to find Camilla. Oh wait, maybe she's... She's showing him. Nope. Camilla, Camilla. Wait, don't tell me Camilla's not here. Okay, this is the blacksmith. May the gods watch over your battle, friend. Hey, woman, are you Camilla? I no. own the lumber mill and pay a fair wage. Wait, See my husband do something with this. Wait, 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 wait. Listen. Oh, man. Only worry we've got is the war reaching this far. Hmm. See, I would have gone to Camilla because then you're still the good guy. But now you're part of a lie. <laughs> it doesn't matter though. <laughs> yeah, I am now. Wait, um, it's not showing at the map where Camilla is. So I guess we'll just have to go to the houses one by one until we find where Camilla is. One, two, Sven and Hilda's house. Alan Gerdu, Alvord. Wait, whose house is this? Sven and Hilda's house. Alright, let's just go to the Riverwood Trader. I think that's where it is. Oh, yeah! Thanks so much, Boxy Cat. Sorry, I got confused there a bit. Okay, guys. Here we 
are. Oh yeah, I get some it quests from so this guy. To us to have the claw back where it belongs. Oh Thank really? You. Wait, wait, wait. I just need to talk to you. Wait, wait, wait. There's beauty here, <laughs> unmatched. It's a fine day with you around. Oh really? But it's gonna be even better when you read this letter. While it rains. Another poem, I bet. He does know how to make a girl blush. What's this? If that oaf thinks all I'm going to do is stay in that filthy house of his and clean out, you can tell Sven that he already has a mother. I'm not speaking to him anymore. I'd better get go. <laughs> wow, thank You're you so much, Camilla, and thank you so much, Luxy Oh, wait. The Riverwood trainer is back to the way it used to be. There's some other requests from me. You and me. Uh, oh, a bit of this. Let me just sell some items that. before I go to find them. Yeah, 750 gold. Wow, that's nice. Hard fire, sell. Amethyst, no. Filter. Yeah. Bone mill. Why do I have a bone mill? Clay. I have 26 clay. What the hell am I doing? Oh, wait. In this. Mm. Once for forty seconds, throw in oil. Why do I have these items? Okay. Lock bit. Yeah. Till next time. Bixi Cat says, Now the elf will be your follower. Oh, you might have to dismiss your current follower. Ah, okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. It's okay. As long as we get the archery training. Just most probably Lydia, my house girl, will definitely be gone. But. At least we still have brother Verulus. <laughs> I already have lots of companions. <laughs> Wait, where's file then? Oh, there you are. Quick save. Riverwood's agreeable enough, I suppose. Find that rather. For a Nord village? Maybe you've already met Camilla Valerius. I don't think Camilla will be spending any more time with Sven. I appreciate your help. Please, take this. Some gold I've saved up from working at the mill. Wow. Follow me, I need your Ah okay. Yes! Looks like you've already got someone with you. Uh oh wait. I can cancel her. Divine smile on you, friend. Uh, okay. So he'll follow me, he'll become my apprentice. So I can take gold back, I see. Archie 50. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna tell Lydia to wait. Oh wait, where's my other companion? Wait, I can't find my other companion so I can tell her to just wait. <laughs> Where is she? There's beauty here. If only Camilla shared my Lydia? Yeah. Or even knew about her. Hmm, wait. I can't find my other companion so... <laughs> she should be here by now. I know. Let's just travel here quickly. Oh. ah, there. Let's just travel. Okay, my companion. So, oh. my other companion. Let's go. My other, com other companion, she's not Riverwood's showing herself enough, anymore. Ah, oh, there, there you go. Finally. Where have you been, lady? Still here. Wait. You lead, I'll follow. Oh, thank you. Wait, wait. It's before I dismiss you. There. Thank you. I've got now, your back. Wait here. As you wish, my thing. Oh, where's, where's Findal now? 
Damn him. He should be here, I think. Yep. Hello. Maybe you've already met. Looks like you've already got someone with you. Oh, shocks. Uh, so I guess I won't if be able only to... Camilla shared my affections. Mm. Or even knew about them. Okay, Bugsiket, I have a problem here, so... I already dismissed Lydia as my companion. But Sven still... Still doesn't want to follow me. And this one... Farewell. Don't worry. I won't be able Arcade to dismiss this one absolutely. yet. So I guess I'll have to postpone my archer training with Sven Are you a hunter for by now. chance? The hill surrounding the village was right Oh wait, I can dismiss her. Oh, I thought wait is the same as dismiss. Wait. So... <laughs> I'm gonna do this again. Oh, Kalidia, Bosika told me that I can dismiss you. We heading out? Uh, ah, there! There. <laughs> Bye, Lydia. It's time for us to park base. For now. I'll head back home if you need me. Okay. Thank you so much, Lydia. Please do wait for me while I just finish my archer Honor training, to okay? You, my pain. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. Bye, okay, back, Sven. Yeah, I always thought that wait is the same as dismiss. <laughs> Turns out it's not. Thanks to Booksy Cat. There you go. There's beauty here, unmatched, and lead the way. There you go. Then we can talk to them. Talk to I'm him. I'm right behind you. There. What do you want me to carry? Wonder what I can trade with him. Uh, I do something. Steps. Oh, guys, that's something new. A follow. Bootsicat says, a follower will give up waiting and go home after 48 hours. So that's nice. So that's how I lost my other companion. <laughs> I told him to wait, and he just kind of lost. What do you want me to carry? Okay. Uh, actually, there's no training for now. Off. Um, when I talk to when I talk to Findal, I've got your back. The only options we got are wait here. I need you to do something. I need to trade some things with you. It's time for us to part ways. So let's try. I need you to do something. All right. What is it? What do you need? Eh, let's just wait here. <laughs> Anything else? Maybe we need to do something to have the option for him to train us. There. Hmm, Fendal, how will I make you train me? I'm right behind you. Is something? I need to trade some things with you. It's time for support base. What Lead is on. my archery skill? Okay. Actually, I don't know. But we're about to find out. I'm a level 33 adventurer with an archery skill of... Wait. What's this? Oh, I need to level up. Okay. My archery skill is... 74! I have an archery skill of 74. I think that should be enough. Um... Do you think that's the reason why I'm not able to train with him? Oh, even I didn't know that I already have a 74 archer skill. That's nice. Yeah. Wait, I think it's because... He can train. Um, Bosiket, if I'm correct, you told me a while ago that he can train me to archery 50, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's why. To be honest, I didn't even realize that my archery skill is already at 74. 
Yes, at least I know now how to do this. So thank you so much. When I start a new game, definitely I'll go to Sven and find that right away. And get your advice. So guys, that's a good advice by the way. Thank you so much Booksy Cat. So I'm gonna get Lydia for now. But what are my skills anyway? Nice. See, I didn't even know that I have a level 74 archery skill. Recover twice as many arrows from dead bodies, okay? Able to move faster with a drone, ba. Oh, I need this. For a few ch seconds. Can draw a bow, 30% faster. I definitely get this. 6170, so I just need 4 more. Bullseye requires 100. But ah, then I want quick shot. Bixie Cat says power shot is a good perk. Yeah, I think I also got it. Or not yet. Oh, not yet. <laughs> Arrow stagger all, but the largest opponents 50% of the time. Okay, we're taking this. Thanks so much, Bixie Cat. We might have power shot. What else did they get? It's been a while since I checked my skill, my skill tree by the way, so I'm just gonna check it quick. Keep pressing block while aiming will zoom in your view. Okay, that's nice. Zooming in will bow slows time by 50%. Oh, that's nice. But not yet. I think I need to spend my perks at some, something else. Critical shot. 15 chance of a critical hit that does 25% more critical damage. Nice. Boost do 40% damage. Ooh. But I don't want overdraw yet. That's nice. 40% damage. Not steady hand. It's okay. I didn't get steady hand. So I'm just looking at the skill sets right now i don't think i'm gonna be getting any skills right now i you think you get because i want bull I, I actually want this quick shot but i guess i need to be to have 100 percent level in archery for the bullseye before i can get to quick shot so there steady hand 2 will wreck your archery timing actually yeah that's what i've been afraid of with it but Okay, overdraw is first perk. You need overdraw. Okay, overdraw. Bugsigat says overdraw. Ah, here you go. Sige. Alright, guys, let's correct the mistake that I did the first time that I played this. I thought I wanted to be a melee fighter. But I really want to be an, wanted to be an archer. <laughs> but we'll do that next when we start a new game. But for now, let's turn this melee fighter into an archer. Thanks to Booksy Cat. We have five perks. Let's go. Two. Okay. 60% more damage. Okay. Booksy Cat says. You can have quick shot now. Oh really? But how? I mean. Oh yeah, I can. I thought I couldn't a while ago because. It's in, uh, there's a line from, oh, once I have power shot, I can have the quick shot right away. Oh, thank you so much, Booksy Cat. If you didn't tell me about this right now, I would have gone with the overdraw skill. But I want this right now. Because, you know, it's nice to draw your bow 30% faster. So I have two perks left. I think I'm gonna spend them now with overdraw. But recently, I'm just using my bow and arrow instead of my mace. Okay, and last one. Ah, it requires archery level 80. Okay, we'll come back for you. At least we now have the best archery skills thanks to Booksy Cat. Yeah, I really need this quick shot. Thank you so much, Booksy Cat. So I guess that's it for skill 3. So we, re we already have enough. So I'm not gonna need I'm you for now. 
It's time for us to park to his final. I'll head I'm back so home sorry. if you need me. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk to you again once I start a new character. But for now, let's go to Lydia. Lucy Cat says, let me see your snake tree. Sure. I'd be delighted to. Snake tree. So my snake skills is now at 7 to 1. And look at this. Stealth. Hmm, okay. So currently I have one stealth. I don't have backstab but I do have muffled movement which is 4. Noise from armor is reduced at 50%. Okay. Then backstab I still don't have this. Take attacks with 100 weapons now do 6 times damage. Although I don't think I'm gonna be needing this so much because I am, like what I've said, I'm gonna be using my bow and arrow from now on. So, but guys if you want me to use the mains, still okay. Let the aim. Sneak attacks with boost now do three times. What? Holy mother of Damn, I think I need this. Yeah, uh books again. I think I already saw what you're trying to show me right now. Yeah, deadly aim. Sneak attacks with boost now do three times damage. I always do sneak attacks with my bow and arrow, so I think I'm really going to need this. But right now I only have um, from stealth. Oops, sorry. I don't have backstab yet, so I need to get this before I can get this. But right now I only have one perks to spend. Yeah. So. So guys, I can't have deadly aim yet, but definitely I want this one. So for that to happen, I need to get backstab. So. That's that's what we're going to spend our perks right now. Backstab. Right. For the next perk that we will receive, I will definitely spend it on dead aim. So, basically, thank you so much. Uh, you're really helping me a lot with this bow and arrow thing. <laughs> so, thank you, thank you, thank you. There, guys. We have a new, new skill set. Thanks to Buxicat. It's as if he gave us an overhaul of our skills. <laughs> so, thank you. Um, I know that Lija, the, the other companion that I have a while ago, lives in Whiterun. But I saw her going this way a while ago, so let's try and see if we can still catch up with her. Maybe so. There I go, Boxycat. Wait, before I just go, I just want to try out my bow and arrow. Now that we have those, it's now 30% more faster. 1, 2, 3. Oops, sorry. One, two, three. There, it's faster now. Wow! That that makes a lot of difference. Look, guys, look. Look how fast it is now. Before, and haven't... Oh, guys, I already have Warframe installed. Nice. Maybe we'll play that next time. Uh, going back to my bow and arrow. Before, when I'm going to stretch it out, it takes like... One, two, three... But now, after the boxy cat skill set, it's like one. Only takes one second, so that's like two seconds less to draw, which is nice. Thanks so much for that, boxy cat. Really appreciate that. <laughs> okay, uh, where are we? Oh yeah, we're looking for Lydia. And I love that companion. What's her bow damage at? Um. Hold on a second. I'm not on it. I'm not quite sure, but I think we can search it from here. Glass bow. Oh wait, it's not this one. Yeah, where can I find my damage? Oh. Skills maybe. I'm just not quite sure where we can check the damage Buxicat now. But I'll figure that maybe later. <laughs> Seriously, I, I never thought about the skill sets or anything when I started the game. I just really want to kill some bad guys. 
Boxy Cat says, just look at the bow. Oh, okay. Um, items, weapons. I'm using glass bow. So, ah, oh, there it is, at the bottom. Glass bow's damage is 37, but my current damage right now, I guess this is it. Besides getaway, it says 45. So I currently have 45 damage using the glass bow. Maybe we can. I don't know, maybe we can equip a different arrow for this. Because I'm missing an iron arrow. Which only has an 8 damage. It said like 37 damage. That's really low. Yeah. So far, I haven't really found any other more powerful bow than glass bow. I'm hoping I can get some at my future quests. Or maybe buy a powerful bow at some inns. But right now. Yeah, 37 is the best one that I have. Plus this weak arrow. Which I will now <laughs> replace with ebony arrow. Oh nice. Let's look at this. R2. There. Lucy Cat says, let me see your smiting skill tree. Oh sure. I'd be delighted to. Oh wait. Skill tree. Um which reminds me, I've never really used my smithing skills before, so... Oh, here it is, Bixi Cat. It's at level 36. Oh, how, how come I am at level 36 if I never used this before? Anyway. Man, so here it is. <laughs> Let's see what this can do while waiting for Bixi Cat to play. So Bixi Cat, here, it is, here we are at smithing. I have 36. Can create steel armor and weapons at forges and improve them twice as much. Okay, I think I already got this. Wow. You can improve magical weapons and armor. Okay. Can create elven armor and weapons at forges and improve them twice as much. Can create skilled and plate armor at forges. Looks like it says, okay, you wear heavy or light armor. I'm actually currently wearing heavy armor right now. Um, you can just look at my character. There. Those are ebony armors from head gauntlets to the boots. But the body armor, I think I just changed it recently. The body armor that I'm using right now is... Oh, there. Ebony armor. So it's ebony. Ebony all the way. Ebon armor, ebon helmet, uh, this one's Nordic card boots, Nordic card gauntlets, and ring of stamina. So, there you go, guys. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, by the way, books get you're from UK, no? So, it should be around 4 12 pm at your country. <laughs> Thanks so much for being with me right now. <laughs> Okay, so you want to put perks into steel and dwarven smithing, then make a dwarven bow and improve it. Oh, okay. So guys, Buxicat will be right back. Thank you so much, Buxicat. Noted. We'll do that. I hope he comes back soon. Because, damn, I haven't really smith done any skill set. Before. <laughs> Wait, where's my beautiful companion again? She's at White Run, so we'll go to White Run. Alright, let's try to follow the trail. I'm just curious if we can, you know, maybe follow at Vegas Trail, because I'm sure she's gonna be using the road anyway, going to White Run. So there we go. out of curiosity. Who knows, maybe we'll catch up with her walking. Okay, so next after the sneaking skill, we'll focus more on smithing. Make a dwarven bow, then improve it. Just like how Boxycat said it. Nux. <clears throat> there we 
Where do you go? Okay, where does white run leads to? White Run White Run says here So let's follow this trail <laughs> Man I am so excited to use my bow and arrow after what Pussycat did to my bow and arrow skills <laughs> Imagine drawing your bow and arrow from one second That's a big difference that's the reason why I didn't focus more on my bow and arrow skills before. Because when I first use it, it like takes like 3 seconds before it shoots an arrow, which is too long for an enemy when you're fighting an enemy. Especially if they're coming right at you. So this is really a big help. Now I understand why other players would still opt in using bow and arrow because you'll have a skill that will make you use it within one sec. Oh hey, Bus gets right back. Buscat says, the more enchanted smiting equipment you have, the better. Oh, okay. You can also make improve a dwarven crossbow if you are done guard. Okay. And he also said, an enchanted drone crossbow does more damage than a dragon bone bow. Well, you could deal with some potions of marksmen as well. Power shot causing a stagger will really help. Okay, noted, noted. I am really looking forward to that stagger actually, so hopefully... We can use it soon. Oh wait. Where's wait time? Oh, yeah. Ah. There we go. Oops. Enhanced, not enchanted. All right, thank you so much. Noted, noted. Wait, what date is it today? It's in the real date, September 6th. <laughs> Enhanced drawing crossbows ignore 50% of armor. Seriously? We can kill them easily with that. Oh. But I think, uh, well, in most games that I've played, whenever I'm using crossbows, they're slower than the normal bow, right? So I'm not sure. I'm always, uh, I mean, I'm always for faster weapons. <laughs> you can enchant an enhanced. Ah, that's what he meant. You can enchant an enhanced weapon, I guess. So there you go, guys. If you also want to have a, like, Pimp my skill set. Go and talk to Buxicat. <laughs> Seems like an expert at it because he just pimped my skill set from 0% to 30% at least. There's White Run. Yay. Yes, they are slower and noisier than a bow. Yeah. Okay. See. See, this is just. Um. I played lots of other RPG games before. I just noticed that, you know, for some reason, a bow and arrow is always quicker and has a medium damage. Crossbows always have a high damage, but are always slower. So, <laughs> I guess I'm correct with Skyrim. It's the same. But we'll still try some crossbows later it's when we find some powerful ones. It's just that whenever I'm using ranged weapons, I always opt for the faster ones. Yeah. Have you got alchemy ingredients? Have I got al Actually, I do, but I think they're all in my belly now because I just consume all of them whenever I get one. I mean, I'm not sure how to use them, so... Yeah. I think I always use them. Oh, here, by the way, this is uh, Soul Reaper's advice before, I think. See these items guys, we'll sell them all later. But right now we haven't killed anyone yet, so <laughs> let's do some damage first and we'll can we'll go back for the for the items that we can sell. Okay. 
ebony armor. So, what you get for the alchemy ingredients? Uh, I don't have that much yet because I always end up spending them or not necessarily spending them, but using them or selling them. Where is Lydia? I hope she's still here. Internet Lydia. You are a welcome guest, but you must still respect the rules of the Jarl's household. Okay, maybe she'll give us some quests, guys. We met as youths and forged our friendship in the fires of war. When he became Jarl, I insisted on serving as his protector. He had no cause to argue. Gods, you are curious. Almost dangerously so. Write this down. Oh sure, I will write whatever it is that you are gonna give. I'm actually writing everything that you said a while ago. <laughs> you know, uh, what we can do with smithing, what we can do with the bow and arrow. So, it's like, Man, I'm seriously taking everything that you're saying seriously. <laughs> I'm really thankful for that, by the way. I'm so thankful that you're here watching. <laughs> I've got my eyes on you. I wish Wait, I have some sound service? effects that can Remember clap your hands, like but I don't have rare. that that kind of software yet. So just please accept my clap. Thank you, thanks so much for Buxicat. Oh, there you go. Juniper berries, elves ear, spider eggs, canis root. Did I say that right? Canis roots, or is it canis root? Anyway. Okay, guys. A while ago, it's for smithing and skill sets. Now we are getting the most excellent advice for alchemy. What more can we want from Busicat, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Okay, there. Mix two of those ingredients together, but I would keep the canis root for a different potion. Oh, okay. Noted. Fear not. Only noted. Come dragon or giant, we'll be ready. There we go. I am so thankful that I am live streaming, live streaming right now. By the way. <laughs> Ain't nobody high and mighty in these halls, except in the Yarl. And don't you forget... I might just be a servant among lords, but don't think for a moment I don't take my duties as... If my cleaning gets in your way, just say the word and I'll be off. Okay, I'll be off then. Hmm, we just not yet here at the palace. Maybe we should wait for her, or... I don't know. Well, Buxicat says that they're cancelling the combined ship after 48 hours, so maybe she'll be back here after 48 hours? Right, let's look for her anyway. Oh, hello. Can you still some items? Ah, oh, boring. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing Oh, speaking of enchanting like weapons and armor. Warriors. <laughs> I didn't know that Farangar Secret Far also talks about this come on let's learn more ah, student of the craft you'll need to start by learning an enchant yeah, take an enchanted weapon or piece of armor then use the arcane enchanter to learn its secrets the item is destroyed in the process so be wary once you know an enchantment you'll need a filled soul gem and something to enchant you'll use the arcane enchanter for that too mm, of course I, I have everything you need for sale if you have the coin <laughs> Oh, that's why he's teaching me because he's a merchant also of alchemy items. But we'll do that later. We're just gonna get some information right now and possible quests from him. Yeah. Books get says, Canis root, imp stool, swamp, fungal pod, or human flesh. Mix two of those together for paralyzed potion. Ah, okay. Wait, I can also put that in my bow and arrow, right? I mean, shoot. <laughs> Guys, let's just 
listen to what he has to say. Maybe Falengar Secret Fire has some quests other than the I enchantment. believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salts for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them oh, from see, one of her potions. One quest. <laughs> Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? I'm sure Arcadia yes, will yes, provide yes. some okay. form of recompense. Let's imagine how strong our bow and arrow would be if we have Paralyze Potion. Even if I'm fighting against 5 or more enemies, as long as I can at least shoot one of them one by one. Wow. I'll be much more powerful now. Thanks, Buxicat. Buxicat. But for now, um, I'll deliver the Frost Souls. Oh, see. At least we have new Good. more quests. You're clearly better suited than I I'm am collecting quests, by the way. <laughs> Buxicat says, Dragons and drugs are immune. Oh. But it's hilarious to hit a giant with Paralyze. Really? I love fighting giants, by the way. Maybe I'm gonna do... Uh, look for one first. I mean, wow, if you only saw what I did to giants, I always like roam around looking for giant camps just so I can fight them and have fun with them. They're the best creatures so far that I've if been I in was a tedious question, would you I don't know if the dragons can replace meant? them as the best creature, but so far, as long as the best creature that I love playing or playing around with in Skyrim are before. giants. <laughs> Now, they heal over. I'm a busy yeah, man, <laughs> and your pointless questions are boring me terribly. Good day. Oh, wait! Don't go away. I still have some secret quests for me. I'll put it simply, so you'll understand. I advise over. the Jarl in matters of magic. If the Hall is faced with any threats or mysteries of a magical nature, I am called upon to explain things and suggest a course of action. Hopefully, that answer will satisfy you. Good day. Good day. Wait, don't go away. One more, one more. It seems this damnable cut. Sadly, no. My work affords me few opportunities for such an adventure. Perhaps some hero will bring one to Dragon's Reach, like old Olaf one I once did. What a fascinating conversation that would be. Okay, thanks so much for the information that they're giving. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the main After you deliver this support. frost salts, the shopkeeper will like you and let you take many items for free. Damn. Let's finish this quest. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Um, before anything else, I'm looking for Lydia, so that's like my personal quest right now. So let me just look for Lydia one last time because I like that companion. Ah, uh, here she is. I am your sword and your shield. Really? Can, can you also be my wife or something? Is her Until next time. There's a trick to magic. Don't Lead the way. Oh, Buxicat, by the way, um, by speaking of giants. Knowledge to do so. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. Hmm? There. <laughs> well, just again, just in case you want to watch some YouTube videos. By the way, that's that's also mine. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me, I prefer my books. Maybe some of them will give me some quests. Um, how about you? Or do you have some have more quests? My attention. No doubt, he thought it was the only way to make his point. And also, because he knew he could. Mm, okay. No more if quests. It's the war you're referring to. I'm on the side of Whiterun. No doubt, General Talius and his friends in the Empire will tell you that I owe them my loyalty. And perhaps I do. Ulfric Stormcloak would say that I owe my allegiance to the Nord people as they fight for Skyrim's independence. Perhaps this is also true. The day might come when I am forced to draw my sword for one side or the other. But that day has not come yet. Yes, maybe one day someone will bring a freaking dragon to Dragon's Ridge. <laughs> Yeah, it's known as the Skyrim Space Program. Which one? Ah, you watched the video? 
You mean the, the, the one that in the video is called Skyrim Space Program? I think I already know why. <laughs> if that's the case. With good planning, even now, Mike, we must also have ample. Re <laughs> but our greatest. I guess I think we already acquired too much quest for now. So before we move on with the other quest, let's just fight some dragons or go to some dungeons. Then later. Okay. <laughs> you know when I did that so video, it was I was so. <laughs> I just find it so much fun that I couldn't help myself by creating another video for it. But I didn't know that it was a space. It was called a space program, or for some reason, since I was just enjoying myself anyway. <laughs> Damn those great names to oblivion. When I was starting, they they said that you know. Your children. Your sucks and I shouldn't be I shouldn't even live stream it because it's an old game but man I don't think this game will ever get old. And the graphics look Woo Alert Alright bro see you later Damn guys Boosy Cat I'm really so thankful with that guy Oh guys, there's a nearby blacksmith. Maybe we can sell some armors here. I got the armors in the in the waterfall anyway, so let's try it. let's just try it out. Ah, it's already PM, so most likely the stores are already closed. So new plan, I'm just gonna sell the items, then fight some dragons. We're going to sell all of these items. Because they are very valuable items. Let's get this one. Anyway. Okay guys, let me just sell these items. Got some good I don't claim to be the best blacksmith in White Brand. Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage?
Don't forget to check inside. Shop if you need anything. Got some good peace looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Until next time. So you guys, I think we can now fight some dragons, finally. Or if not. my horse again <laughs> I keep losing my horse horsey where are you maybe it's in the stables well, I'm hoping it's in the stables it should be somewhere here or there this the entrance so Table should be here, I guess. Yeah. Are you my horse? No. Nope, you're not my horse. Horse, my horse. Ah, I keep losing all my horses. <coughs> Can I fight without my horse? Let's try... Cannot wait in the air. Okay guys, we're here with one of my most favorite enemies or creature in Skyrim which is the birthplace also of, as Muxiket said, the Skyrim space program. <laughs> now let's use this bow and arrow! Finally! 
Oops, not like that. One. See that? Another one launch into the space program. It's nice. Now I, it's like now I can literally wow. She finished it. I can literally shoot an arrow every second thanks to Boxy Cat's advice. I like this. Oh, so sorry, giant. But do you have any gold? <laughs> I really want some gold. Hey, why, why do you... Or see. Wow, oh, black soul gem, that's so expensive. See, this is what I want about <laughs> giants. They're fun to kill, and they have the most gold so far, giving me... 200 to 300 gold per kill so that's for one giant which i think is a high amount of money last me so we can i guess we can yeah we can sell this okay okay let's let's read another giant <coughs> giant piece Oh, it's not yet cleared. <sighs> so here we are at Sleeping Tree Camp, hoping to see some giants. Oh darn it. The sky is full of clouds right now. You know guys, if during night in Skyrim, if there are no clouds at the sky, you'd, you'd really fall in love with the sight. The creators of this game made so much beautiful. And even if it's just a game, at night you'd still love to look at it. The stars, the moon, the sky, everything. Just to know. Hmm. But right now, on with the killing. Which leads us to target number one. One. Fifty-eight gold. Not bad. Come on, horse. Let's move on to the next.
Okay, another giant. Let's get this. Oh. Hey, not me, not me! Not the horse. Bad angle. Oh no 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 no! Shucks. Not the horse, please. God damn it! Oh shucks! They keep hitting the horse. They are hit him instead, not the horse. Oh, okay, they don't seem to be following, following me now. Maybe they got tired, so it's now my turn. Oops. Giant. There's two of them actually, but if they kill the other one, then I don't know where the body is. I won't be able to retrieve the gold. Lost the other giant. I don't know where the body is. So we'll just move on to the next. Second discus. Oh yeah, forgot about that. Nice archery at 75. Should have paid attention when we were fil when we were killing the first giant so that I know what where to retrieve the body. But anyway. Let's go now. Next cam. First, ready, aim, and fire! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! See that? Another one was sent to the giant space program.
Trinity. Try and he got me. My horse keeps leaving me. friendly oh yeah the imperials Oh wait, this is skeleton. Oh my god. I thought it's the enemy. <laughs> Silly me. There, that's an enemy. Follow me to this giant, I dare you. Oh, he has the cow! The cow ritual is actually working for the giant! Go giant, please attack these bandits. There you go! Thanks giant! Ah! Not the horse, stupid man. Go giant, not me! Welcome to the space program! Thank you, Giant. I love you. Sorry for your cow. A1 bandit down. How many more kills? Let's see if the Giant will notice us if we just walk past here, I guess. Hi, Giant. How's your day, man?
attacking. Oh, that's, that's nice. He's not interested at me. That's a lucky shot. Horse did it? Ah, crap. Shock, horsey, why did you have to attack? Hi. I'm faster now. Oh, that's nice. How can you still live with that? <laughs> Look, <laughs> it's already in his head and still alive. How's that possible? Sorry. Oh, stagger is useful. I think that's the last of them. Did, I, did my horse survive? Oh no, it didn't. Damn it. So sorry, horse. Can't believe this. They killed my horse.
Oof. Shouldn't have gambled with my horse. Anyway, we'll get a new one from here, White Run. Hold on guys. Got my la suppose so. Got one all saddled if you've got the coin. You've got a deal. It's the one with the saddle. Right strong. This one. Yep. Guys, I can see the word giants are. Can you? You can make them come out. See? <laughs> oh! <laughs> he launched one again at the Skyrim space program. I wonder where that one is. Lord Dungeon somewhere here. Okay. As usual, let's just loot some chests. That should be enough. 
sorry. Okay, look at the map. There's another encampment. Just up ahead. That's near. Time to fight with you and looking for the other giant camp. that encampment Whoa. encampment that I've been looking for. Ah, I think it's on the other side. Take me on the other side. Guys, let's explore that place. You never know what's there until you go there. <laughs> Obviously. Below this place, so huh? can you see? Up, oh, up, oh. nice horsey, don't die on me. But surely. Away from here. Sleep behind in the river. Oh yeah, we need to return to the river with again. Oh. Hey, look, I came. Wonder what's inside. 
it over with. Nope, not that one. Nope, not that one. Here. Okay, guys, time to move on to the quest. Main quest, actually. Guess the inn is closed at, during this time, so let's just wait three hours. There it should be open by now, I think. <laughs> I still don't have any idea what we're going to do in this quest, but hopefully, we get something out of it at least. That's our way out here. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room, but you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. So you're the Dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. <laughs> Follow me. Okay. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. Close the door. Why? What are you gonna do with me? <laughs> do to me. Now we can talk. Whoa. Damn, woman. <laughs> You're not gonna rape me, are you? Please no. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. <laughs> Guys, which one would you like me to answer? You're the one who took the horn. Sorry, I'm supposed to be meeting someone here. The Greybeards are right. I am Dragonborn. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna go with, <laughs> with this one. This one seems too obvious. So, let's go with a little badass answer. I hope you're just playing dumb. I'm the one who left the note in Ustengrav. <laughs> What's up with the cloaking dagger? You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. But you better have a good reason for dragging me here. I just came here for the hunger. It was the only way I could make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Hmm. <laughs> Should we say this? I don't have time for this. Some badass answer. Um. I think the story is meant for me to listen to her, obviously. But I gotta go for this and see what I will happen. I shouldn't let you walk out of here knowing what you know. But I guess even my paranoia has its limits. You know where to find me when you change your mind. Oh. Because you will. You have to. That's nice. Hey. You ready to hear me out? <laughs> Let's try I'll this I'll explain one. what I want when I want. Got it? You'd already be dead if I didn't like the look of you when you walked in here. But I had to know if the rumors about you were true. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Is 
seen it. If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. <laughs> yes. We're very old enemies. Old enemies and if my of suspicions Balmer. are correct, they hmm. might have something me. to do with the dragons returning. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. Why are you looking for a dragonborn? We remember what most don't. That the dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You are the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? <laughs> That's none of your business. You're wrong. It is my business. You may be the only one that can stop these dragons. But you'll understand that soon enough. Okay, okay, okay. We remember what most don't. That oh, the dragon... You're the only one that can kill so a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Let's go with this one. I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeards sent and not some Thalmor plant. Okay. Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Do you love me? Oh wait, I don't want to know that. Do you know how crazy this sounds? <laughs> ah. A few years ago, I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. Well, it turned out he was right and I was wrong. Okay, okay. You should know. You got the map for me from Bleak Falls Barrow. The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. Okay. It seems to be spreading from the southeast down in the Gerald's near Rifton. The one at Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. Mm. Kynesgrove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, wow, maybe we'll learn how for to two hours. Nice. Am I ready? I can't wait around for you to make up your mind. I'll meet you at Kynesgrove. <laughs> Don't waste time getting there. Do you need something? Dragons are coming back, and you're a born dragon slayer. Fine. That's all you need to know right now. Kynesgrove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Kinds grow. Ah, There's an see. ancient dragon. The faction that rules the all. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. Okay, the Empire so barely survived. That huh? Let's get on the road to Kinds um, I just hope Kinds Grove is already updated on the map. Because if it's not, then we just have to find it again. I guess it seems we're going to fight another dragon this time. Hopefully soon, because I don't know where Kynes Grove actually is. Oh, there it is. So I can either go to the grey beards so that I can continue my training or go ahead and go with her and kill the next dragon. So that's nice, that's nice. First kind skill. I 
Let's see though. This is Rift 10 already. According to my compass, my objective is can be east. Ah, east, not south. This kind of screw. This kind of screw. Pine's Grove is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. Wait, where is she? Is she that one who's running away? I think that's her, so... Dog. Is this you? What is ah, it? yeah, shit, that's her. She's just dressed different. Come on, we've got to get to Kynes Grove. Ooh, nice. Oh, Booksy Cat! Hello, man. Nice to have you around again. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm going to follow her to Kynes Grove. <laughs> Boosie Cat, you're just in time because I think this quest is gonna be awesome. We're about to kill some dragon. At least one dragon. As said by her. Keep a sharp lookout. We can't afford any delays. We can't afford any delays. Should have picked somebody else for your dinner. Wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> I thought she was referring to me. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I missed. Go on. I don't like it. Let's go, let's go. I doubt the calendar are aware of you, so we should be safe with them. Enemies. You're not an enemy? Oh no. Friendly. Guys, can you look at that scene? I hope your dragon born are really good. But we'll find out soon enough. Wow. I really love the details on this game because of this, not the city. Like a real Viking city. <laughs> Wait, we're still feeling. There. Let's go and kill the dragon so I can have my coffee break. <laughs> Guys, do you see that? Not looking for trouble. Need to get to How awesome is that scene? 
most of the time when I'm roaming around with my horse in Skyrim, I just look for places like this or some sceneries like this. Especially if the sun is bright, because it's just so amazing to see. And to think that it's just a game. But it looks as if it's real. And even if it's not, it's like a picture that you'd want to see. Well, not right now because there are lots of clouds. Is this a friend or foe? Foe. Argonian. Nice. Or human Argonian. Better to stick together. I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. Sweet. I'm gonna use this as my wallpaper sometime. <laughs> Just gotta take some pictures here. Well, it doesn't look real, but it looks like a fantasy landscape, which is what it should look like. Oh, okay. I guess that's the term that I'm looking for. I mean, yeah, I know it's not real, but still. <laughs> I just love looking at it. So maybe that's the term that I should be using from now on. Fantasy landscape. Nice. Hey, why aren't you moving? Hey, Delfin, move now. Damn it, she stopped. My analysis is correct. The dragon buried near Kynesgrove will be the next to come back to life. The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, down in the Geralds near Rift. The one at Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. Come on, we've got to get to Kynesgrove. All right, lead the way. She's not leading the way. Oh, there we go. Ah, finally. Should have picked somebody else. Whoa! Where the hell did that come from? That takes care of. They both end up dead, but at least it gets me out of Riverwood. I don't really think I'm cut out for the quiet life. Getting here. <clears throat> Wait, where are we now? Okay, we came from Riverwood, right? So Riverwood is somewhere. Somewhere. I don't know. But let's just continue with the quest. Haha, 
the saber cat is hunting the deer. Wait, where is she? I think I lost her. Oh wait, here she is. Fantasy landscape. Gone again. Oh. This is a notorious bandit hunt, but it's also the shortest way to Kynes Group, so you may have to kill a few bandits. Bandits here are dumb. Yeah, she keeps saying we must really. And she keeps saying that we're not looking for trouble, but damn. Instead of running, she's fighting this woman. Maybe I should shoot her down. Better to stick together. I don't want you to get yourself. Yeah, I actually thought we're going to fight all the bandits, so I'm kind of disappointed she didn't. But anyway, you know what? I'm gonna tell you something else since she's. I wonder what will happen to the story if we didn't make it due to an accident. That kind of accident, I mean. What if I accidentally shoot her with a bow and arrow? supposed to die your main character oh yeah she did it oh wait let me just read the comments i've had her going to you can kill her some characters are essential yeah yeah <laughs> i just tested out if she's one of those essential characters so just curious okay i'm gonna load the game oh and she's up <laughs> what 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 now delphine <laughs> Yeah. Actually, even my companions, uh, if I accidentally attack them with a ground spell or anything that hurts them at least, or up to 50% of their life, all of a sudden they become hostile as well and kill me. <laughs> Out of reach, I guess. So, but still, I just want to kill some of them. <laughs> Oh crap, this NPC is having trouble navigating her way to where we should go. Oh, okay, good. Good job. <laughs> good job to recover. Oh, who's that? Hello, are we friend or foe? We'll cross the white river yeah, I know, like nothing happened. Did you unlock Mark IV debt yet? Um, I don't think so. I haven't earned any new skill set yet. New, new perks yet. Wait. 
we're still seeing over there. So no new perks yet until I level up. Yeah, what level am I anyway? Smithing, I'll get you later. Just gonna check, okay. Oh, it's a shout. Um, wait. Actually, I'm not so sure. I do have a few shouts already unlocked, but I don't have Dragon Soul yet. So, ah, here it is. Basically, I do have it marked for that. Speak and let your voice herald doom as an opponent's armor and life force are weakened. So, there. I do have it, but I don't have a Dragon Soul yet. To spend on any of the other shouts that I already have. Hopefully, we do once we kill this dragon that Delphin is guiding us to. Oh, Delphin, go faster, please. I'm getting sleepy. Remember, yes, it's unlocked. Um, I think Soul Ripper told me that we need dragon souls to unlock all the shouts that we have. So. Hopefully, by the time that we kill this dragon, we can, you know, use one of that soul for mark of death. Is it useful though, the shout mark for death? Are you using it often? I mean, how helpful it, can it be? I thought it's a mud crab. Better to stick together. I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. Luxy Cat says, I kill dragons quicker than you kill the wolf. <laughs> I, I, I guess so. I hope not though, because I'm really looking forward to the challenge of dragons, you know. Whenever I'm fighting enemies, I always love to fight those, the hardest ones in the game. I, I don't know what, but it's a bit pleasurable for me, I guess. There's an inn at Times Grove, the Gravewood. I hear they serve a nice dark ale. Nothing on the sleepy giant. Keep a sharp lookout. We can't afford any delays. Here we go. can afford any delays, ha? Huh? And then you keep, en you keep engaging. I play on legendary difficulty. Oh, yeah. You know, I, I didn't even recall that there was a difficulty level setting for this, but... Like, what I do with all open world games that I play, I purposely don't play it on the hardest for the first time. I play it on the normal setting so that I can still enjoy the story of the game. And afterwards, once I finish the entire story, that's the time that I choose the hardest difficulty setting. Like in Horizon Zero Dawn, that's what I did. I didn't play the hardest yet. It's the normal just so I can play the... So, so I can enjoy the story, the game itself. But after I finished it for the first time, wow! Good. I can use the Lots of times I repeated the finish the game on the hardest difficulty setting there is. Oops.
Yeah, legendary is my fifth character. <laughs> Hopefully, I also get my fifth character. Because <laughs> I'm really looking forward to restart the game. Um, starting as an archer from the very first skill settings. So, it was my equipment. But right now, I'm already enjoying the story of the game. So, I guess I'm just gonna go on. <laughs> oh, that is an awesome name. I like that. Zenith. I'm just gonna kill this Kujit or something. And he's a brother. Nice. Wow, oh, you already have your fifth character named Zinit. I wish I also have my fifth character right now. But definitely, man, once I finish this game, expect me to play it again all, o all over. Using a different character. <laughs> I can use the practice. How many times are you going to delay our. Taking me. <laughs> Not too much farther now. Kind Grove is just down the road. Southeast. The zenith is the highest point of an art of the best it can be. Oh, really? I, I didn't know that. Wow. <laughs> Highest point of an arc. Okay. That is cool. Sounds like you really thought that, uh, I mean, you really researched on that name before you used it, huh? Nice, nice. How would you know that, by the way, about Zenith? Are you an engineer or architect or something? Just curious. I think I lost Delphine. The one before that was Johnny. Ninja Johnny. <laughs> Wait. Are those... Are... Oh! Wait! Wait! There's a dragon! Wait! Whoa! I don't know where Delphin is, but I'm definitely going after that dragon. I'm old. When I was young, I read a lot of books. No, no one's old. We're all young at heart. Actually, me, I'm also, I also love reading books. But I guess I'm old. <laughs> I'm not that old. Guys, there's the dragon. Wait, I'm just gonna try and shoot this dragon. Maybe lure it to me. Wait, I'm gonna save the game. What? Whoa! Dragon, come here and fight me! Shots! No damage yet. Ah, shots! It's getting away! 
There, I'm engaged. Finally, I'll do it. Where's Delphi? I don't care. I think I upgraded my skills to bow and arrow. Damn, I suck at this. He wouldn't stay in the same place so far, so. Need to get closer. Boxycat says, that's not the dragon you're supposed to be fighting, haha, <laughs> really? <laughs> well, he's here now, maybe we can just have some fun with him. Gosh, we haven't done any damage yet. So there are random dragons that we can kill. Good to know. I can't get the correct bearing. Alduin is here to resurrect another dragon. That's the dragon you fight. I'm going to fight the dragon that Alduin rules. Okay, so most. If that's the case, then most probably Alduin is also an essential character that won't die even if I try to do so. Thank you for letting me know. <laughs> okay, but still. It's nice to see Alduin beforehand. Can I just damage him? I'm just curious. I guess not. Yeah. There are. My arrows are hitting him. So there guys. Thanks to Buxicat, he said that he won't be able to kill this dragon because his stone is going to resurrect a different dragon that we are supposed to fight with Delphine. So. <coughs> I know, I know, stay by the car. Up. Save the game. Never know, guys, never know. Marker is this anyway. Locate the dragon burial site. Okay, so I guess we have to go around or something. Part of the road continues here, so let's follow this road. that we're supposed to be fighting. The dragons, Halok, near. Nice. Wow. Dude, books again. The bow and arrow setting skill set that you gave me seems strong because now the dragon is fucking dead. That even took a minute. Damn. I hate you, dragon. I hate you. Whoa. So you really are.
you some answers, don't I? Oh, definitely. Whatever you want to know, nothing held back. Well, again, it was a weak dragon, yeah. How are you doing for gold? Um, actually, I'm just selling items and stuff, and killing giants, which gives two hundred or three hundred gold each per kill. I'm one of the last members of the Blades. <laughs> a very long time ago, the Blades were dragon slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest dragon slayer. For the last two hundred years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. Okay. You know about the dragons. Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. I've seen this dragon before. The one that got away. Really? Where? It's the one that attacked Helgen when Ulfric escaped. Interesting. Same dragon. Damn it. We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. The Blades who are they? Exactly. Nobody even remembers our name these days. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone, though. For the last 200 years, we've been, we've been searching, searching for... for the next Dragonborn to guide and guard, as we are sworn to do. But we never found one, until now. What's the next? first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Remind me where Hot Mist in Tarmor being dragons. Back. Nothing solid yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. Mm. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? Mm. If we could get into the Thalmor, problem is that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could take. Mm, I'm, I'm not, not sure, sure yet. I have a few back in Riverwood. If Riverwood I'm not back again. when you get there, wait. Sorry, Buxicat, I just saw this. Oh my god, did my stream stop? Okay, sorry I just read, I wasn't able to read your comments a while ago, I was reading the <laughs> Delphine statements. Anyway, um, I'm gonna suggest you go shopping for some equipment, but you'll probably need 3,000 gold. Okay, that's fine. But before that, I can get you a free dragon soul, maybe 15 minutes to do. Okay, free dragon soul, I'm, I'm okay with it. Oh, 
Oh uh, wait, let's see if it's un... No, not yet. So yes. Yes, I want a free dragon soul. <laughs> I don't think a free dragon soul is part of the campaign. So... I'd really like to know where I can get one. <laughs> But before that, I need to sell some item items. Custom grab, okay. But hold on a minute, eh, because according to my items, the carry weight that I have is 345. It's already full, so I'm just gonna leave some on the on white run again. I mean, below the water there. <laughs> Then we go to Unsten. Unsten. Yeah. We go back to Usten Grab. Wow. That name sounds so cool. Wait, white run. There we go. Yeah, but they they actually um They actually have a good price for them. 300, 500 gold. So I still keep them. <laughs> Just for selling purposes. So I can sell them here right now, but that will take a lot of time. So I can do that later. When I'm not on my live stream, I guess. But for now, um, I'll just leave all of them underwater here. Hey. There you go. Let's just try and leave our items here. So it won't be too heavy for me. <laughs> 1118. Nice. Drop. What else? There. See? Value of one dragon bone is 500 gold. So that's 1,500 gold right away. But the weight is 15 each. Ouch. So I'm gonna drop that for now. Drop this. Ebony armor. Ebony arrow. Nope. What else? Farangar's Frost Salts. Farah Salts 3. Garnet. What else can I throw? Glass Maze. Um, I think I'm using this one. Ulstan Grove is north of Morthal and south of the abandoned shop. Wow! <laughs> you memorized the location? That is so awesome, man. <laughs> The shop, you can deliver those salts now. The shop is 30 seconds away. Ah, you meant the frost salts? It's the frost salts, right? Okay. Let's deliver them then. Oh, okay. You looked it up. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Much appreciated, actually. Okay, I'm just gonna drop some of the items here. So what I do most of the time, I just drop the items here during my live stream. Then after I'm done with the live stream, I sell them one by one, which takes longer actually, because you have to wait two days before the mer the merchant can refresh the amount of gold that they have. So there. So guys, please bear with me as I drop all of my I most of my items here. Uh, what else can we drop? Purple mountain flower, sapphire. I think that's enough. I already have this. I already have this. 
fireballs, fury, stuff of spikes. Wow, I have lots of staffs. Maybe that's why I'm carrying heavy items. We okay. You're welcome. Yes, thank you so much. Um, all those petty soul gems will come in very handy if you want to get your enchanting skill up. Soul gems. You mean this one, right? Okay. Noted, sir. Will do. Will do. Okay. I just hope that they're not lost when I come back here. Hey, why are not? Why aren't the books submerging? Submerge already. They don't wait. They don't wait. They don't. Uh, they're not that price anyway, so I guess it's okay to leave them. Wait, wait what, are we, what are we going to do again? Ah, yeah. The salts. Frozen salts. Petty soul gems filled up. Okay. So we can use them through alchemy. I'm just going to look for that miscellaneous Frost Souls to Arcadia Okay Let's see where we can find Arcadia Here Oh there Meet Dolphin up, oh, not that one Hmm, where could Arcadia be? Stuff better if you be you can be bothered you could store your stuff better if you can be bothered yeah go to that alchem what do you mean bothered uh, go to that alchemist in the main market main market wait um i came from there so the main market should be it took me weeks to find that thief's death i can't stop now but i can't have you heard there's been another dragon attack Main market is near the entrance, so I'm guessing they're all. So here, here, this one's the blacksmith. Blacksmith, so alchemy. How about this one? Uh, no, more like an inn. So let's search more. More away. Oh How about this one? Is this al? Nope. It seems like it's just a house. Oh, barracks. Sorry. Oh, one, one more level up. One more level up. Okay, okay. Foxy Cat says, Go one level up, then find the main circle market. Okay, thank you. So we'll start looking one by one from these houses. Because I'm not very familiar with White Run yet. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Ew. So I guess this is the main circle market. So. Ask yourself, sneak thief. For I am the chosen of Talos. This doesn't look like an ultimate. Dude, the open circle with stalls. Ah, you mean that kind of. Okay. I think you meant this one, right? Because it has stalls in it. So there. Oh, by the way, um, I miss if the soldier's life, there's a bit I of latency my from my, my stream, so I know I made the right choice. You know, by the time that I read your message, sometimes it's just a bit late, so I apologize for that. <laughs> but please bear with me. I assure you, I'm reading all of your comments as soon as I can. Straight in front. Dun, 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 dun. This is it, right? <laughs> um, cauldron. Yeah, I think this is what he meant. Uh, let me go inside. Sell the frost salts. There. Let's 
So we're supposed to give the frost oh, halts to Arcadia. Pale. Could be a taxia. It's quite a problem back home in Cyrodiil. You hate this woman. Oh come on, let's kill this woman. Yeah, you son of a bitch. Just kidding. Pardon me, but do I'm I gonna take finish my quest first before I kill you. I have several elixirs for sale. Do you want me to kill this woman? Let's kill her later. After we get the frost salts. Ah, splendid, splendid. It's for a special brew I'm working on. A love elixir like none other. Maybe I'll test it on Farangar first. Maybe I'll test it on oh, Farangar first or you face some you, compensation. woman. Um, here. These potions should suffice. Nice, nice. So, I like some training in alchemy. Uh, we can do that later. It's worth for the frost salts. So, you're a healer. Uh, later, I think everything's here. I don't know. So I think the next quest that we should do is Anytime, click system, click quick save, glass, then click ebony maze and maze of Molag Bal, get in front of her, and then do... Oh shit, what the hell? Whoa! Why is there a white blood guard here? How the hell did you get inside, man? More fights, yeah! Nice. Oh wait, there's one more? Where the hell did this go? Where the hell did you guys come from, huh? Mmm, I love that. This ends now. Why the game but I just want to kill these guys so, no, no. I always love fights ah she's not he's not dying huh? wait never should have come here come on, uh -huh, come on, science. <laughs> stream is back oh thank you so much thank you so I guess I'm going to load my quick save a while ago before I killed her. I just want to do that for you, man, because you hate this woman. <laughs> so come on, let's see. Um, what else? What do you need, my friend? You look rather um. pale. What have Could, you got for ah, sale? So you're an alchemist then? Yes, I'm the full metal alchemist, bitch. Oh, sorry for the word. Oh, look, uh, she has a Vicky and Longfin. Blister word. Uh, what else? Bone meal. Okay. We're looking for books, uh, berries, elves, ears, spider eggs, canis root, so. Ah uh, yes, she has Canis, Canis roots actually. See the leaves hanging from the ceiling. Can you take those without stealing? Okay. Um, we'll see. She has Canis roots by the way, so I'm just gonna buy some before I get the grass from the ceiling. And what else? Canis roots. He also said something about um, spider eggs, berries, juniper berries, and elves ears. So let's just see. Elves ear. Oh, she has elves ear one. Let's buy that as well. Okay, spider eggs maybe. But juniper berries. Oh, she has one juniper berries. Nice. Then spider eggs. I hope she has one at least. Spider. Ah, oh, there she has spider eggs. So, wow. I already got the four. Ingredients that you told me a while ago uh, Juniper berries, elves ear, spider eggs, and canis roots Death bell, um, I don't, I think I have death bell or maybe I ate them already <laughs> uh, She has seven death bells, come on let's buy all Boom, there we have death bells as well 
and something else useful for me i guess i'm gonna buy some potions for life or health potion this <laughs> Busiket, are you watching this right now Pardon look at me. where I'm pointing at a case of the rattles I've got something for that I can harvest the dry elves ear <laughs> so I'm gonna do that now without stealing that is elixirs for sale to drive elves ear they don't look like an ear they look maybe like a hardy nord like you leaves. doesn't need a cure all huh or maybe they're normal what leaves they just potion. called Else here. Basic cat says buy the ice ray teeth and need vampire something? dust. Okay. What do you need? Take a look. Seems like Boxy Cat is cooking something else for us again, guys. <laughs> ice ray teeth. Okay, now we have the ice ray teeth and vampire dust. You know, I have lots of vampire dust before, but I just threw them away. Two vampire dust. Okay. There. By the imp stool. What? What? What are we going to use this for? Is this a st oh, okay? It's a mushroom. Okay, there you go. Salt pile. Ah. I like this. Nice. Mm -hmm. There you go. Do you have fire salts, mm -hmm. by the way? I just, I just want to check. So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Four fire salts. Do you have any? Oh, yeah, she has. All right, then. Now go to the alchemy table. I think you're referring to this one, I guess. I'm gonna quick save it. There. I sell cures for all ills, and I'll be happy to serve you. Okay, Booksicket. You're on. <laughs> Thank you so much for this, by the way, because you know me, I'm. I just really want to kill those You'll enemies. Tonics, so. Salves, poultices, and I'm not used in making ingredients for alchemy. Content. Salt pile plus death bell. Salt pile plus death bell. Um. That I'm not able. I don't think I can. Oh wait, here you go. <laughs> if there's anything I salt can help pile, you one salt pile, then that bell, okay. Then I think you meant craft, so I'm going to click craft, okay. So, just box. Created poison of slow, discovered side effects, slow that bell, slow salt pile. Wow, that's nice. Um, is this what you want? Did I get the ingredients correctly? Or no? Okay. Blixicat says ice ray teeth plus vampire dust. That's a good concoction. But keep trying these ice things. Ice ray teeth plus Alchemy vampire dust. Okay, then craft. Nice. There. Ailments, both common and rare. Do let me know if I can be of service. Okay, 
so now what's next? I already have that. If there's anything I can help you with, Buxicat says Juniper berries plus elves ear. I'm enjoying this by the way, so I'm I'm really thankful. <laughs> Cause I'm not usually I'm not usually doing this, so I'm excited to see what happens. Okay. That's the effect from juniper berries and elves ear. Browse to your heart's content. Elves ear plus spider egg. That's nice. There. If there's anything I can help you with, you have but to ask. I sell cures for all That's ills. Imp's tool. Plus canis roots, so still. nice. Done. You'll find tonics, salves, poultices, and potions on my shelves. Browse to your heart's content. We're done. I wonder what we made. <laughs> With alchemy, yes. <laughs> well, I must say that was exciting. I, like I said, I never used alchemy before I because I just go out and kill enemies and all. So now what? A few handy potions. So oh, okay, okay, noted, sir, noted. I offer remedies for ailments both common So this time we're gonna go out now and find some enemies. Pustan guard. Ah, I see. Okay, noted. Noted. No, maybe later I'm gonna... Since, by the way, since you said that my video a while ago is known more commonly as the Skyrim Space Program. I think I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna do some more. <laughs> I don't know why it's fun to do that to the giants, no? Flying high high in Skyrim. Using giants. <laughs> using the space program. Now go to Ustengarag, which is north of Mortal. Okay. I'm just gonna go out first to get my horse, then let's fast travel to that place. Ah, uh, I might stop my stream later, a little later, by the way, because it's now 1:21 a.m. <laughs> I might need some coffee or I get some sleep. Still, I'm still enjoying. So let's just continue this. Where's my horse? Where's my horse again? I, I think I my horse died. Anyway. Mortal is somewhere here. Oh yeah, Usten Grav is just like south of my south of my house. <laughs> oh it's 622 here in UK. Nice, nice. Horse at stables, okay, but uh, I'll let's just get some horse later because we're going inside the dungeon anyway. I don't think we'll need the horse yet. Hopefully. Oh. By the way, guys, I just want to say thank you so much for watching me right now. Please, Skyrim. So, please like the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. <laughs> oh, that's one solid <laughs> strike. Nice. Ah. 
rabbit hunch good thing I have strong allies more importantly good thing I have books cat <laughs> So we go in the dungeon, we want to go back to the altar where you found the note. We can use the shortcut you used to get out back. Oh yeah. I think I remember that. So It's a good thing that they thought about making shortcuts to whenever you end the quest, no? It's very useful. Nice. One quick talk. Ah, yeah. This is it, the shortcut. Yeah, I think this is the normal way, so I'm gonna go back. Yeah, I'm gonna look for the side room. I, sud I suddenly realized that as well, that I'm not following the shortcut. I was following the original way, the throne room where there was a note. So let's just backtrack a little bit. So here's the map. So here's the from the map. Oh right. So this is where the junction should be. The shortcut is above this room, I guess. Or maybe it's this one. Wrong room, okay. Uh, sorry, by the way, uh, we have some latency books I got, so I'm just going to backtrack until I see a uh, fork in the road. So, oh, here we go. I think this one, no? So, I'm just gonna go slowly from this because I remember the room having so many urns. So, I think it's this one. Yeah, I think this this one. Th this is the correct shortcut. I remember now. <laughs> okay, what's that? There we go. Yeah, this is now the correct path going back to Unst Un Grove. <coughs> My throat is getting a little dry. I haven't drank any water. <laughs> since I started streaming <laughs> but no worries guys we're gonna go ahead with this quest and finish Boxycat's quest oh. okay so behind us should be the throne room oh wait Good. <laughs> okay so Boxycat now this is the throne room where we found the note the note was on that middle portion of that room 
activate the altar okay I didn't know we can activate the altar let me try so far no activation okay so far no activation I mean no button where it says we activate it Looks like it says right in front of you, activate it. Okay. I think you meant this, but so far I'm just looking for some buttons here, okay. Get close to it. Maybe at the other side, I guess. Oh man, no button to activate it so far. Maybe there's a different switch somewhere. You've given the horn back to the Greybirds, yes? No. I don't remember giving it back yet. Did I? I think no. Because... Ah uh, yeah, I haven't. Look at, look at the quest. Look at the quest. Uh, they return to the, hor the horn to Arngar, which is one of the Greybeards. It's not yet ticked. So I think I don't have that yet. So maybe sometime. <laughs> we can go back to Arngar now. Ah, uh, okay. No, that's no problem. That's okay. That's okay. No problem. So next, um, we'll do this when we have when we finish that R return horn quest, which is something that will happen in a few minutes from now. <laughs> Hello. Okay, no problem, no problem. That's fine. We'll do all of that, don't worry. Yes, yes, you're right. At least coming back will be easy for a dragon soul. Yep. Thank you so much. So now we have to get a horse first before I go to Rotgar. But anyway, let's just save the game. Oop. Save the game. Yeah, but yeah, I guess that's it for now. Um. Guys, it's uh, 1 30 a.m. on our time, so I think I need to hit the sack for 30 minutes, then I'll live stream again, probably. <laughs> that quick, no? <laughs> yeah, Boxy God, I need to go now as well, so thank you so much. Maybe give me an hour of sleep, then I'll live stream for the rest of the day. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much for watching. So for the next episode, it's how to get a free dragon soul by Boxycat. <laughs> so much. See you later, guys. Bye. Thanks so much. I'm gonna. This is now Josh Gaming signing out.